Welcome to another episode of AKRNE Fitness, your favorite YouTube fitness channel. In this episode, you have myself and Whitney doing V-ups with the stability bar. So we did three sets of 10 reps of this exercise. And if you know how I count, we do, I count by twos when I'm doing exercise like this. And what I mean by count by twos is when I go up and give my feet the ball and then come back and get it, that equals one. So just when I go up each time, it's like a half of it. So there, then there is equivalent to one rep. So I did three sets of 10 reps of this exercise and it is an ab exercise. See, there's four key words in this statement. Most potent, underutilized, and free. Most potent means it's the strongest antidepressant that you can get. Underutilized means they don't, people, we don't use it enough. And free, everybody knows what free means. We all love free. So if it works better than everything else, why are we not using it? You know, if this is the best way to get yourself out of a funk, to get yourself feeling better, why are we not using it? You have to realize, and that's why I tell people anytime they say something about they're not feeling good, they're depressed, they're this, they're that, I say, man, work out. And they think I'm trying to be funny because I like to work out, but I'm not. It actually releases chemicals into your body that make you feel better. Look it up, research it. See, these are harsh words in these quotes, and I'm not calling anybody any of these things. But in retrospect, who, who wakes up and says, man, I want to be weak, or I want to um, not have enough money to pay my rent, or I, I want to not be able to walk to the end of the block without being able to catch my breath. So these things happen when you don't have a plan. Nobody plans anything um, to make them weak or to make them not capable. That's what happens when you don't have a plan. So set a plan set a goal to be better to be stronger to make yourself money whatever to make yourself better and set out and achieve those goals with a plan it's easy to say you're going to do something but the real discipline comes in when you actually get yourself up and do it i have a handful of people who do what they say and i see them on a regular basis in the gym i have myriads and myriads and myriads of people telling me saying that they're going to show up but you know i don't see them i'm not not knocking anybody we have life and we have um responsibilities and i understand that but at the end of the day stop telling me start showing me start showing yourself at that you know it ain't even important about proving it to me prove it to yourself and do what you say you're gonna do Everything is a gradual progression um, from weights to anything else that you're going to do in life. So you start by doing what you know you can do, what is possible, like they say. And then as you get stronger and stronger and stronger to get to a point where you're doing what you thought was impossible, what you what seems impossible to everybody else, you get to a point where, where you're doing things to the point that people ask you, you know, how do you do that? Somebody just asked me the other day as far as my energy is concerned, and I, that's what I told her, I, I build upon successes I, I get to a point where i'm okay i'm doing something that i thought i couldn't do and then i add on to it after i'm able to do that and continue and continue and continue and get stronger and stronger and more and more resilient at the end of the day your workout should be for yourself you should be working out to improve you for you because if you're doing it to impress somebody else you never know what the outcome may be you could be sorely disappointed I'm going to use myself for an example. If you're trying to impress me, it's going to be extremely hard because of the fact that I've seen a lot of very spectacular individuals. So if you're trying to impress me by your abilities, that would be hard. But if you're trying to impress me by being, the best way to impress somebody is being yourself. That's the way you'll impress me, per se. But be you, do you, and do it for yourself, but not to impress other individuals. As always, I want to thank you guys for watching another episode of AKRME Fitness, where we change the world one workout at a time. With that being said, me and Whitney are done with this particular part of the workout, and we'll be back with another one very soon.